Tell you more about that in a minute. Austin Flager from Northridge in lane number four. Timothy Martin, Jeffersonville in lane five. Theodore Steinkamp from North Central in lane six. Trey Kolick from Castle. And then Sam Losher in lane number eight, Columbus North. Tell us about what makes this young man from Batesville so special, Tony Young. Well, he doesn't have a pool. I mean, there's one thing about that young man. He's been persistent. He club swims the majority of their time through his swimming career and then tries to piece together training. This young man's been an important part of age group swimming in Indiana for a long time, but he's also been one of the unknown high school swimmers. Watch him try to steal this race. But watch out for lane number four, Austin Flager from Northridge, a senior going to Purdue. This is a redemption time for him. He was seated first going into last year's 50 freestyle. 50 freestyle sometimes a crapshoot. You really got to stay focused. Watch Flagger here. The record is 20.11 set by Wagner back in 2011. Again, your lane assignments, top to bottom of your screen, bottom to top of your screen, we should say. Lane number one at the bottom, lane eight at the top. Tim and Arrow with a great start, and he is a strong young man. Speed coming from lane number five. That's T. Martin. First to the wall is T. Martin, but not a strong push off. Middle of the pool was Flagger with under power underwater. He's going to take it, but can he get the record? 20.37, a win for Northridge, who's come out of the gate storming today. Northridge, 20.37 in second. Team Arrow from Batesville, 20.83 in third place. Martin from Jeffersonville. Steinkamp from North Central of Indianapolis. And Colic from Castle rounds out the top five in the boys' 50-yard freestyle. Outstanding 50 freestyle. 